This is calculator question number 20 from the March 2019 SAT. College Board is again asking us a word problem involving a diagram and a table where they want us to find the correct numbers in the table to perform the mathematics they're asking for. Specifically, they're asking for the ratio of the price of hay baler A, I'm sorry, hay baler E, to the price of hay baler C. So that's this column for price, and it's E over C, which is 46,900 over 32,000. And they're specifically saying the ratio, which ratio is closest to the percent by which the price of E exceeds the price of C. So when we get, take this ratio, we'll get a fraction slightly over 1, and on my calculator, that is 1.4656. If this ratio was exactly 1, the amount by which we exceed the price of C would be 0. So the 1 is just matching the price, and then the decimal is how much we've exceeded. 1 is match, and the rest is how much we exceed. And 0.46 is 46%. So 0.466 rounding would be 46.6% is the amount by which we exceed it. If they wanted to reverse the ratio, they could ask what percent is the price of Baylor C of the price of Baylor E, and then E would be the denominator. But since they're asking about the amount by the percent by which you exceed hey, Baylor C, C is the denominator in your fraction. That's probably the most challenging part of this question, is correctly identifying which number is the numerator and which number is the denominator. The College Board will often ask you to do these, so a lot of practice on interpreting data from tables is helpful before your SAT. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.